Hey, V. You ready? I'm nervous, Tom. How'd you know? First time you've done anything like this. Just imagine you're doing what a doll does. Just a different program. You're great at that. So glad you came. Molded over in my head, y'all were right. Sometimes the only rational course of action is a kick in the nuts and a bullet between the eyes. Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. And Maiko? Where's she? Meeting with Hiromi, to avoid raising any suspicions. She'll make him stay put until we're in. Remember, let the behavioral chip do what it wants. You got no time to deliberate, weigh decisions. Just follow your instincts. Freeze, tense up for even a second. Could cost you your life. You got it? All right, we going in? Let's do this. You two, head in right after us. Go straight to clouds. About fucking time. Stay sharp. Gangoons might be lurking. Got a jacket and a panel on the other side. Can you take him out? What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at Clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Okay, on my way. Elevators on the other side. Be safe. Right, on the roof. Jump down onto the balcony. Careful, though, okay? What you calling me for? That's right, I'm fucking nice. You don't want to see me not be nice. Uh-huh. Yeah, we'll see. I'll be late. I told you, I have shit tons of work. No, don't wait up. I don't want any fucking dinner. Everything you cook tastes like sawdust anyway. Love you too.
dinding. Wah. You coward! You don't deserve to live! you'd make less trouble getting here. Luckily, they're all jacked into virtues. It'd be game over otherwise. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. I don't like her either. She tries too hard. Could have called off the guards, you know. Would have been quicker, simpler. I don't have that kind of authority yet. Why are there three guys? What she planned? That's our target, Hiromi Sato. Don't have authority yet? <laughs> you sound damn sure of yourself. Left no room for error. We're exactly where we need to be. Who are the other two? target audience of today's presentation. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on I my face. I know the claws. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Maiko! I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? Michael, our plan made no allowance for witnesses. A show of force, we said. And any show requires an audience. I know how this needs to play out. Better than anyone. You gotta trust me. I thought this through many times. Don't like this one bit. Too late for second thoughts. Tom and Roxy have done their part. Your little doll revolution is underway. Either we consolidate and win it all, or let everything go to waste. Meaning you want to replace Hiromi. Mm-hmm. Even if that means joining the Tiger Claws. How the fuck else do you expect me to protect clouds from other gangs? Do you think? Well, she is no Barker. Wait. What's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromi Sato's time is up. This Merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. He murdered Oswald Forrest. And now he's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck's she doing? Clouds need new management. Am I to understand that this future manager stands before me now? Hold on, Michael. I think you're getting carried away. I see not all has been agreed. V, you gotta take him down. That's why we're here. 
Dolls of Clouds are declaring their independence. Club will be run by them, and only them. V, let me do the talking. Tiger Claws will get a cut of the revenue, but they'll have no say in how the club is run. Stop this right now! I'll get everything under control. You cannot even control your own mercenary. Hiromi will answer for his incompetence later. Whereas you will answer for your insolence. No. no Matter of fact, I do. Either you walk away and never come back to clouds, or I end you here and now. I see you got everything planned out, but you forgot just one thing. I've also got a doll chip. <laughs> It's on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Down to street level, waiting by the food stalls. Fuck. Should have seen that coming. Probably had this planned from the start. Same sec we walked into her office. Jesus, am I a gunk. Who cares if she was scheming? We did it. That's what matters. Clouds belongs to the dolls now. was the plan all along, and you made it happen. Thank you. See you later, V. See you around, Judy.